Hi guys, um, this is me, Ethan Strachan, and today on EBS Supernatural, I'm back with another exciting uh, video for you guys. Um, I'm sorry that I haven't posted any more uh, videos recently. Um, I was uh, very uh, busy as usual, but don't you worry, um, there'll be more uh, videos uh, coming up on my channel. So, as you can tell by the uh, title, um, I have found some uh, pictures for for brand new ideas for making more interesting ventriloquist dummy characters. So, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you some uh, pictures which I've found on uh, on the internet. Um, I do apologise of the uh, of the uh, camera quality. Uh, it's kind of a little bit uh, buggy. It could be some issues to the uh, iPad. But I do apologise of the uh, camera quality. Um, hopefully, like, hopefully after a couple of minutes it will behave itself. Um, it's just a little bit buggy, so I do apologise. So, so today, as you can tell by the title, I'm going to show you guys some pictures of different uh, ventriloquist dummy uh, characters. Um... It's kind of like a, uh, it's kind of uh, similar to that uh, video of where I was been talking about like ideas for making future ventriloquist dummy videos. Um, if you've seen my, uh, if you've seen that video, I was been reading uh, some comments that you have, uh, that you have commented. Um, so yeah, um, if, if, if you're new to this channel, um, if you haven't seen it, you can easily uh, check it out. It's on my YouTube channel. So, so let's begin. So, I found some uh, pictures. So, let's start off with the uh, first one. So, as you can tell by the uh, character, this is uh, Billy from the uh, 2007 film Dead Silence. Um, so, here's the uh, first picture. Uh, he looks very, very terrifying indeed. And I'll show you the other one. Um, so as you can tell for this one, uh, it's kind of a, uh, it's kind of like a, uh, clean, uh, paintwork. Um, so basically in the film, uh, he's also seen as a clean version. And in this one, uh, he's kind of like a dirty one with all the cracks and the dirt on his face. Um... I'll maybe have a think about, like, maybe if I'm creating the character, I'll maybe think about, like, I'll maybe think about uh, making him as a uh, clean version or a dirty version. I'll maybe have a think about it. But, who knows. And here's the uh, other picture. Okay, there's two more. Here's the other picture. And here's a, uh, here's a little, uh, profile picture of his face so yeah um hopefully i will sculpt the uh face just to make it more accurate i'll show you the uh the other ones so here's the uh second um character this is uh the uh this is the uh TV show uh, Slappy from the Goosebumps TV show. Um, here's this picture, and here's the other one, and here's and here is uh, his uh, full body. Um, so yeah, and here's um, okay. So there's two more. Okay, um, I think this one has to be one of my favourites, so that'll hopefully, that'll give me an idea of what his uh, face is going to look like. So, so yeah, so basically his face is sculpted and his hair is sculpted, so hopefully I will figure that out while I'm sculpting, sculpting his, uh, his uh, head, excuse me. And here's the last one. So I'll get the uh, other ones. So, 
so the next one is kind of uh, unusual. Um, um, I don't remember any like uh, comments like asking me to make that character, but here it is. Um, this is uh, Willy from the uh, Twilight Zone uh, series. Um, here's a uh, picture of him. And this is what he looks like in the uh, in the uh, TV program. It's just basically a uh, bl black and white picture of uh, Willy from the uh, Twilight Zone uh, series. Well, from that Twilight Zone uh, episode. So here's a picture. Here's a uh, another picture. Just making sure that there's no pictures on this. So here's the uh, picture. And here's the uh, last one. Uh, so this one's in uh, colour, so that'll give me an idea of what his actual colour is, rather than black and white. Um, so as you can see in this uh, picture, he's wearing a uh, sailor suit, so hopefully I'll find a, uh, a screen accurate uh, sailor suit. Um, so yeah. Okay, so on to the uh, last uh, one. Um, this last one is not really a uh, ventriloquist dummy character, but it's pretty interesting. So, uh, for the past uh, couple of, uh, well, for the past uh, couple of uh, months and weeks and all that stuff, um, this uh, kid uh, asked me to make a, uh, a uh, Nola Holmes uh, inspired uh, ventriloquist puppet. So I've uh, found some uh, pictures. Um, kid, if you're watching this, I have uh, found some uh, pictures online, so so you can choose on which uh, idea you want me to do. So here's the uh, so I found some couple of pictures of different outfits that she wears. So if you if you want me to if you want to pick one, that's totally up to you. So here's the first one, and here's the uh, second one. And here's the last one. Right, so I think that's all. Um, hopefully in the future I will have a think about starting off uh, making, uh, making all of these uh, characters. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. Um, don't you worry, uh, eventually I will plan out for uh, more uh, exciting uh, ventriloquist dummy uh, videos. Um, I'm so sorry that I'm off for a couple of days. I was uh, very, very busy as usual. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. Um, if you want to see more ventriloquial dummy videos, if you want to see more videos of my uh, artwork, uh, please uh, subscribe for more so you won't miss any more uh, videos coming up. And uh, if you have any uh, questions, uh, please uh, let me know as well. Or if there's any more uh, ventriloquist dummy characters you want me to uh, create, uh, please let me know as well. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. Um, remember, if you want to see more of my uh, work, uh, please uh, subscribe, subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you guys next time. And I'll keep you guys uh, updated for more videos coming up. So take care. Goodbye.